Hello everyone, this is Delshock and in this tutorial I'm going to show you the best tricks and solutions to fix the PS 2016. So, if you have a low-end PC like mine or medium, so these solutions will, I guarantee you at least 70% will work for you. So, follow me. Let's start with the first trick, which is the easiest one. You right click on the shortcut of the game, then you click open file location. Then double click here on settings to open the settings. Well, sorry this is the French, but I hope you would understand, it's very easy. So first of all let me show you the specifications of my PC for this game. So as you can see the processor is ok, the RAM is ok also, but the problem is with my integrated graphic card Intel which is very low for this game with only 128MB. So that's why it showed me the impossible, but I've managed with these tricks and solutions to play this game with less lags and uh, playable at least. So. Let's go back to display, this will be display here. So first you need to check this full screen. Maybe you'll find it like this. So change it to full screen. Now for the resolution, this is very important guys. So if you have a medium PC, for example, you can choose this one, which is 800-600. If you have a very good PC, then you can choose one of these two last. But if you have a very low PC, then you need to check this one, the first one. So click on that, so it change now, and then you click OK. That's the first trick, very easy. Now the second trick, also very easy. You right click on that shortcut of the game. Then you click on properties here, last one. So, as you can see here, you click on compatibility. And when you click on that, you need to click on change settings for all users. So, as you can see, I've checked these, but for you, they will not be checked. So, make sure to check these five last ones. So, check them all except this one don't check this one please this will make the colors very bad so only check these so when you check these you click apply then you click ok then ok that's all for the second trick now we'll move to the third trick well the third trick basically you need to two programs I'll leave all the links of the programs you need in the description so this one jet clean and this one jet boost you need to download this both programs they are for free so when you download and install the jet clean you double click on jet clean to open that program which is a cleaning program which is very necessary for PCs so this program is very easy to use all you have to do is go to this arrow here and you click scan and repair and will it will automatically scan your PC for old files that you don't need so don't worry this will not delete any important files on your PC only the bad and temporary files that you don't need anymore so just wait I recommend you guys to use this program at least once a week it's very important guys to make your PC very smooth and the performance will increase for your PC so make sure to use it at least once a week you can use it every day if you want so now it's, it's searching and scanning for the errors for the registry clean for the windows for the apps for the shortcuts and especially for the RAM this is very important feature it will clean your RAM processes, the old ones, so it will make your RAM fresh. 
so as you can see I have too many frogs to to delete and too many reefs to fix and so on so as you, as you can see now all these problems are fixed so you can exit this program now we move to the fourth trick which is very important also the second program you need is JetBoost after you download it and install it of course double click on that program and here you can customize the programs and the anything you want to remove from processing before starting your game so this will basically disable any unnecessary program or process running on your PC while playing your game but after that you can restore it after playing your game you can restore everything back so as you can see most you need to check all the services for the same for the non Windows services and for the other just leave the explorer unchecked it's very important because this will disable the desktop icons and will disable this bar so make sure to keep it unchecked that's all go back and here click on boost and it will boost your pc to increase more performance so you'll see the difference by yourself so before you start your ps 2016 you run this program jet boost click on boost and then you can start your game and after you close your game you go back to the jet boost and you click restore and it will restore everything back to normal so that's it for the fourth trick now the very important trick the fifth one uh, you need to download a file which is called crowd disable this crowd disable will, uh, will disable the crowd or the supporters in the stadium because those supporters are causing too many likes for the game so you need to download this crowd disable from these links one of these links of course as you want and when you download this this file go to downloads location so here it is this file you need to extract it So here it is, extracted now, double click open that file, then you open this one, download, double click, so we found these files, copy these files, or cap as you want, so let's copy, close this one, then you right click on the shortcut of the game, you go back to open file location, this time you will open this file which is download inside the PS2016 install location double click so you need to pass these files here yes continue so these are the files that you need just close now so now when you will open the PS2016 game you will see that uh, when you go to play your game there will be no supporters just an empty stadium but the the sound of the supporters will continue so and now the final and the last trick is to download this entire malware program which is called super entice malware professional you find the link of this program in the description below as well so make sure to download this program it's very important and when you install this program you open it so this is a very important program which will scan your pc for any trojans or any malware or any anything that can cause very lags for your pc so when you open this program it will automatically, actually for the first time, it will automatically scan your PC and remove anything that it finds and then sometimes it will ask you if there are Trojans it will ask you to restart your PC to remove these Trojans 
you got to scan this computer and uh, make sure to shake these like mine shake this and this and this also this one and these two also make sure to shake them then you click on complete scan and it will start scanning your PC so this is not an antivirus just something like that but very light and very simple to use and it will as it say here it will remove spyware not just the easy ones I've, I've used this program and as you can see it start to scan and find too many things on your PC for the cookies they are not so harmful but they will cause so lag so just remove anything that you find I will stop the scan for because it will take too long uh, for you just wait until it's, it searches everything and then remove anything you find so let's cancel continue continue so as you can see removal progress fetch removal complete click on continue and then you can exit that program like here right click on it then click exit so that's all for the tricks I hope I hope this will work for you and if you need anything or any help just comment below and I'll try my best as usual to help you guys hope you like this video and share it with your friends and see you soon in the next video peace out guys